Good morning, Uncle Tim. Here we are on a Tuesday, and it's a lovely spring morning here in Gyra. You can see some blossoms beginning to do their thing. So spring, well, spring is officially here. It's just that Gyra's, you know, <laughs> lives on its own time. And uh, we're going to go out for a ride on the old girl today. Haven't been on her for a couple of weeks. Uh, I'll do a video shortly on on this. This is another case of the K-Pox for me. I bought this off a friend of mine in Brisbane a week or so, two, two ago. It was a project bike. It's a K75. It's a K75S actually. Um, and uh, it's got plenty of miles on it, but it's apparently been very well maintained and documented. So we'll do something with that after we finish the K100. Which is not that far away, I just need time and some bits to uh, to get that sorted and shove that sidecar on it. Got to finish that sidecar actually. <laughs> Probably get too carried away with myself. I keep putting these gloves on and it's not time to put them on yet. Now my lovely sister, most esteemed and beloved sister Anne, for my birthday gave me a um a microphone adapter and a mic for this uh, for this GoPro that I've got on my helmet and uh, I'm gonna give that an experiment today, I'd give it a try today and see how it goes better put some fuel on eh? Ah, a bit of choke with the old girl twist of the throttle or two and see how we get fired up this morning come on old Arnold, hasn't been ridden for a while <laughs> a bit more choke again Now, of course, this new microphone with the inside the helmet may give me the opportunity to talk while I ride, which is pretty disturbing for all concerned, really. And I'd probably, you know, probably take me a while to remember that I actually can. And whether you can actually hear me over the top of the noise of the old girl here is another thing again, of course. Anyway, as you can see, it's a beautiful day. Good day to get out on the bike. Here we are in downtown Gyra. Which is a small town in northern New South Wales of about 2,000 people. was Ian, one of the local musicians that I know.
grey nomads will camp anywhere. And you can see the nice spring blossoms on the trees. You wait there, young man. I tell you, I got on the Triumph the other day and took it for a short ride and everything is so stiff on this bike that I keep just overdoing things on the Triumph over shifting this window shall we? Still cool enough. That's the vets back there. There's a lovely, lovely bunch of people, those girls. Looked after Bella all her life. Anyway, so yeah, took the Triumph ride and everything is so light on that bike in function, you know, like despite the fact that it's 2.3 litres and sort of like virtually twice the size of this bike everything on it, you know, the clutch, the gear shift, all those things are very light in action and uh, everything on this bike is very heavy in action
downtown Urella, which I just saw has a population of 2,750, which is about 750 more than Gaira. But Urella seems much more like a much busier place than Gaira. And this is the main street, obviously. It's the top pub. I've played there once or twice over the years. There's Dermot's, that's my mate Dermot's um, Thunderbird Park there. He doesn't drink, so I don't know what he's doing parked at the pub. And it occurs to me, you know, as I'm riding along that I actually forgot to fill up with fuel when I left home this morning. So I'd better do that up the hit up the top of the hill here.